Hello again. Some sad news. This is Worldwide Arms Limited, English UK deactivation weapons dealer. This is the current and final catalogue. Um, after 47 years of trading, it is with a heavy heart that Worldwide Arms will cease trading on the 25th of May 2022. Thank you for having been a loyal and valued customer throughout our 47 years of supplying you with collectible weapons. Marita Rawlings. Um, I've been wheeling and dealing since Worldwide Arms since I was 17 in 1984. And now at the age of 55, I've received their final catalogue as they wind up the business for whatever reason. The catalogue's available to view online as well. Um, no reasons given for while they've gone out of business. But... If you wish to look through this catalogue here, then by all means, freeze frame and see what's what. Probably the bargain in the catalogue, well, there's two, is this DA467. That's described as, or DA67, sorry. This is described as a scarce 303 Longley Enfield Mark 1 Star Bolt Action Carbine, some parts missing, very Good. Reduced to clear, £199. That's probably one of the better bargains on the listing. So we'll go down, if you feel the need to, just freeze frame. And the first thing I ever bought off Worldwide Arms was a 303 P14 bolt action rifle. Way, way back in 1984. It cost me £47. And I've been buying steadily from them ever since over the years. Always received a mail order catalogue. And unfortunately, this one is their final one. And they're also selling off a pig sticker Mark II bayonets for the Enfield number no. 4 rifle. Um, five of for 20 quid plus six pound postage, which ain't bad at all. So we'll go down see what there is M414 is a K98 winter trigger unit and they're selling them off at £17.95 so not bad Energy grenade, they're not badly priced either. Um, box of 15 inert, 7.9 rounds, £12.50. Nagant rounds, NATO 7.62, cleaning kits. I could do with them a Sten loader. So there's some bits and pieces on there to interest me. Back up the top again. So it's not known at this stage if the people at Worldwide Arms have decided to retire or they've sold their entire stock to another company. I'm assuming either way they will have sold the stuff to another company because there ain't no point in them keeping it. But yeah. A really sad day for Jack people in the UK. They were always constant with their bits and pieces. On the back, Over. So yeah, really, really sad day for the collectors in the UK. Worldwide Arms, final catalogue. Um, I'd like to say a, a massive, massive thank you to the people at Worldwide Arms 
for all the service I've had out of them since I was a kid, well a teenager in 1984 and now I, I'm here, age 55, looking at the final catalogue. So thank you Worldwide Arms for all the years of service.